new mom Beth flies to Croatia for a getaway trip arranged via her newly divorced first-class friend, Kate. At dinner, Beth confides that her marriage to her husband Rob has hit a dull patch and is unsure what to do. That night time, they go clubbing and men flirt with them. Kate indicates Beth have a one-night stand. The subsequent morning, Beth wakes up foggy approximately the night time's activities, knowing Kate is missing. After contacting Rob and Kate's ex Jai, each disregarding her worries given Kate's self-targeted and wild personality, she contacts the police, additionally detached. Handius Zane, the Syrian taxi driver who drove them to the club, is empathetic and concurs to help. With his assist, Beth recovers Kate's purse and phone, and learns the men from the club were escorts, employed via Kate. However, they may be con men who drug and rob the ladies they service, like Kate and Beth. With this new facts, Beth returns to the police who ultimately begin an reputable investigation into Kate's disappearance. Rob also arrives in Croatia and immediately suspects Zane. Kate's frame is discovered quickly after in the water, to Beth's horrified grief. She unlocks Kate's smartphone the usage of her face on the mob. Searching her smartphone for clues, she finds text messages among Rob and Kate revealing an affair. Beth is known as into the police station, as their new primary suspect. It's far discovered that each Kate and Beth had drugs in their structures, something Beth suspected due to her memory loss and insists she became drugged. The police interviewed the two escorts, who've no crook history and deny any wrongdoing. The police confiscate her passport as they keep to investigate her. Beth calls Jai and reveals out he knew Rob and Kate were having an affair. Beth calls Rob and confronts him that she is aware of they have been having an affair. The police come and arrest Beth. The police tell her Zane has connections to a human trafficking gang, accusing Beth of hiring him to homicide Kate due to the affair together with her husband. Beth confronts Zane, who says the group transported him into the U. S. A. And not anything more, insisting he had nothing to do with Kate's homicide. While the Airbnb host Sebastian is away, Beth sneaks into his personal recording studio, coming across he secretly facts all of his renters. Searching the pictures, Beth sees she was put in bed early the night time Kate went missing. It additionally indicates Kate being robbed via the escorts, getting into a automobile to document it, and ultimately returning. Beth writes down the license plate wide variety and discovers it is Pavik's automobile, the policeman who doubted her story. Sebastian returns and Kate and he combat. She runs outdoor and Zane is there. They visit the taxi agency and interview the driver who drove Kate that night. He stated Kate had him power her to observe the two men, and subsequently he dropped her off on the police station. On the news, Beth is called a suspected assassin and, whilst out searching out clues, Zane and Beth are pronounced by means of locals, so the police come to arrest them. Beth figures out that Pavik turned into concerned in Kate's disappearance. Zane gives himself up so Beth can escape, but she's caught via Pavik. She accuses him of killing Kate because she rejected his advances and, throughout their battle, he falls off the constricting's ledge to his loss of life. Beth learns that Pavik had a history of assaulting sex employees, however he could not be fired because of a loss of evidence and he was moved to tourism. Due to the post-mortem report, it is believed that Pavik hit Kate on the again of the top and dumped her in the local river even as she become nevertheless alive. Beth is asserted harmless and she or he thanks Zane for his assist. Some day later, Beth gets an SMS from Zane on her manner to dropping Aster off at Rob's for a visit, reading, see you quickly. Rob desires reconciliation, however she refuses. At the same time as looking for her car keys, Beth finds black onyx beads from the necklace she gave Kate in Rob's coat pocket. She realizes Rob killed Kate and, even as on the line with the police, confronts him. He admits he flew to Croatia to forestall Kate from revealing their affair. In flashbacks, it's shown that Rob turned into willing to depart Beth for Kate. However Kate called the affair the most important mistake of her lifestyles and planned to inform Beth. However, Rob tells Beth it changed into the other man around. He admits he got irritated and have become competitive with Kate, pushing her into the water earlier than jogging off. Beth realizes Kate had invited her to Croatia to remind her of who she became before Rob and that she deserved better.
Because the police recorded his confession, neighborhood police are dispatched to the residence. Beth leaves with her child as robbers are arrested. Thank you for listening the story. Please like and subscribe for more stories.